Hello there everybody, my name is Chris Chadongstaborn, Bob Bell for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News and update. This is from Legoland Windsor and this is on some new updates on the Duplo Dino Coaster. This is all part uh, of this brand new investment for the 2020 season. Uh, we do have some more details including two brand new other changes and investments uh, for the 2020 season. And also we'll be talking briefly about something that was announced separately as well. So it's all going off at Legoland Winds uh, this year in 2020. So before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Please, please, please share this channel around with your friends, family, and on social media. And for now, guys, let's get into this video. So this is on Legoland Windsor and their 2020 season. Now, the main thing is the Duplo Dino Coaster. This is going to be going on in the Duplo Valley section of the park. It's pretty much all up there now. Uh, construction is progressing very well on this coaster. It's a kids coaster. It's going to be manufactured by Bat Matt Ride uh, from Germany. It's set to be a clone or similar experience to Bar Express at Europa Park in the Irish section of the park. Um, originally, it was the Dupo Dream Coaster. However, we got the latest announcement that it was the Dupo Dino Coaster. Uh, so you can see on the concept art on your screen right now. Van Abidorsi, that is the official concept art of the ride. You can see it's got that dino shape and that dino design of the trains. But you can also see in the concept art uh, a purple helicopter, a yellow helicopter, and something with a 3 2 1 near the front of the concept image. And that is because they're adding two more things in. Uh, so the colourful toddler theme country Duplo Valley will become even bigger. The Brickville Playground, which is popular, will be transformed into the Duplo Playtown, an exciting rocket playground. Aspiring astronauts can enjoy the interactive game elements, climbing ropes and slides. And for those who reach the summit, there is a button with a 3 2 1 departure countdown. And families can also take to the skies with three new coloured helicopters on the Duplo Valley Airport attraction. Also, the Duplo Puppet Theatre will tell a brand new doll fairy tale that tells families that, that families can see all day long. The Frog Prince tells the story of Princess Moni Plenty, who loses her golden ball in the depths of a murky pond which is ruled by an evil toad. Fortunately, the princess saved by Legoland hero 007 James Bond. The Frog Prince joins the fairy tale of the Godlocks with the Free Bears, which has also been performed for a long time and reinterpreted in a modern and fun way by the Legoland Park. So basically, mainly everything's going off in Duplo Town section of the park for 2020. There is also, as you may have all seen in a separate video we talked about months ago, uh, or just about, 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 around about a month ago, um, Atlantis Submarine Voyage getting its facade redone because of the renamed Lego City Deep Sea Adventure. Uh, we spoke about that in that video. So overall then, Legoland Deep Sea, well, Lego City Deep Sea Adventure, the, refaca uh, the refacading and renaming of Atlantis Submarine Voyage. And in Duplo Town, you've got the brand new Duplo Playtown Playground, you've got the brand new show, new painted helicopters in the Valley Airport attraction, and of course, the main attraction, the Duplo Dino Coaster from Mac Rides. So, big year for the families for Legoland Windsor in 2020. Big, big year. Uh, and I definitely think that Legoland Windsor is going to go for a, for a you know, even bigger year in 2021 with the new Lego Movie World. We spoke about that in a previous section uh, of a video. Uh, we spoke about how that was that was all approved and the plans were approved. We spoke about that in a separate video, uh, you know, weeks ago now. Uh, that the plans been approved for that, so that'll be going down for 2021. So you know, London's got it big in 2021. Chessington's new drop tower. Legoland's brand new uh, Lego Movie World. Uh, just need Thought Park to do something now. I know they've got. I know they've got something in the works. Hopefully, with Aroma Prime Sense that we talked about uh, in a past video. So maybe Thought Park's got something bigger in store for 2021. Hopefully, so uh, we'll see from that. But overall, though, for Legoland Winter, this is brilliant, brilliant family investment, and I can't wait to share the full analysis of the UK investments for 2020. Uh, in a later date. So thank you very much for watching this theme park news update. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Please share the channel with your friends, family, and on social media. And for now, guys, keep it on the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.